I'm super excited that worked. Free food, free food. Love me some free food. Who got movies? Let's Netflix and chill or something. I bring the snacks. Snacks on me. Snacks on me. 99 cents for an item, ladies and gentlemen. This sleet or snow couponing must go on, ladies and gentlemen. There are deals to be had. 54 cents per an item. 54 cents per, de per Rumor item. Rumor is that, that these deals are dead, but let's go test I the water. I paid 36 cents per an item, guys. 36 cents. Somebody per say item. free. Did somebody say free? I love free stuff. 95 cents per an item. Detergent, guys. Don't stop. Don't stop. You gotta run, run, run before they fix this glitch. It looks like. <laughs> Let's go check out. 88 cents per an item. I paid 88 cents it's per an item. Tree hall, 32 cents per an item. Hey, Royal Family. Thank you guys so much for joining me. A lot of you have inquired about my stockpile, and I wanted to show you. So, here it is. This is my stockpile. These are the items that I've collected over my six-month time of couponing. JK. This is my stockpile. This is my stockpile. This is my stockpile. And I only been couponing for six months, ladies and gentlemen. Can you believe it? Six months of couponing. I have collected all of these items here. Now my stockpile is in my back room, my laundry room, so I can't give you a full grand tour. But I will show you some of the items that I have. I have Dove, Caress. These are all my body washes that I have. And then over here, we get to my lotions. I have lotions back here. These are shampoo, conditioners that I have. These are hair care products that I have collected. These are where I keep some of my dryer sheets. These are all laundry supplies. I have my pods up here. <clears throat> Liquid detergent down here. This is packed, packed, packed. These are all games, like game to the back, all the way to the back. All, I try to put them all together as much as possible. Coordinate that. These are my tie pods. They just go endlessly to the back. So down here, I have my scent boosters. Um, I do use my items. I don't go couponing all the time, so sometimes my items do get low. Sometimes you got to execute on no-hand deals and steals when you need to financially do that. Um, however, not all deals are good deals. I got tired of the razor deals, so I kind of stepped back on that, and you'll see why. And these are all of my hand soaps that I have been couponing. Random stores, CVS, a lot of these are from Dollar Tree. These ones right here are from Dollar Tree. These soft soaps, a lot of those are from Dollar Tree. The rest of these are from various stores. Got these on the clearance event sale. Here are some more liquid detergents that I have in this cabinet. So this is pretty much all I have for this space here. And this is just six months, ladies and gentlemen, of couponing. So... And I've been using it, and not consistent six months. I had breaks in between my in between my couponing on and off. So now all the time do I coupon? Is it exactly for me? Sometimes I do it for my family and friends, and I don't coupon personally. So I have took some breaks, and I have been using a lot of my products lately. So I do need to stock up. So here is this cabinet. Let me show you my next shelf. Over here I have this cute little plastic shelf thingamabobba. That I got off the road in the trash. Somebody else's trash was my treasure. And look at it. Just shining, 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 shining. Yeah. So these are my deodorants. I am low. This is a some of my deodorants that I've collected. Um, toothpaste galore. It's not organized. My daughter put this stuff in here. So you have to excuse it. I have toothpastes and toothbrushes. This is my dental care. Here, this is random. I have some of my facial washes and lotions that I've got. Um, that's empty. Here are tons of razors. I just have an overabundance of just razors. And that's not even part of it. Here's a little bag from ones that have been opened. 
and I just put them in a Ziploc baggie. Then I have this whole bag just full of razors from top to bottom. Free razors, free razors, all of this. So I'm not storing that right now. So those are items that I have as well. So, oh, all that deodorant. Look at all this deodorant that I have. And I can't find any a guy who likes um, this right guard deodorant. Guys are so picky nowadays. So, yeah, so this is deodorant that I have. Okay, so here's another shelf. That's junk on top. In here, all my Febreze products, like far as the plugins um, and the uh, small spaces. These are all stored in here. My wax warmer, my wax melts, things like that. All of those items are in this drawer here. And these are just, ah, these are just almost fell, are some of my bar soaps, some extra body washes from when I didn't have room in the shelf to store them. Um, so yeah. We got tons of these in here, body washes and bars of soap, or that caress deal that we did, the dial deal, when you buy one, get one free, buy a bar of soap, buy a bottle of soap, body wash, all those deals. Our free dial, when they had the dollar coupon attached to these mini ones, cleaned up on that one. So, yep, that's that drawer. The next drawer is my medicine drawer. These are all the random meds that I've collected from Walgreens and from the Dollar Tree and CVS. And this is just a small portion. I do have another bag that I have not yet to put in here. But these are the meds that I have. And here is where I keep my overflow. I have some of these little bins. So in these little bins, I have some Lysol wipes, probably got from Dollar Tree, some shaving cream i haven't yet found a place to store these items yet these are probably totally free from walgreens probably bought those and got points my recent new goodie that i just got recently y'all seen the video for these gummies yes i have these car scents that i recently purchased um and here is another overabundance just an overflow of detergent and other items that i need to put away eventually when I get space, because as you see, your girl has nowhere else to put that stuff. Okay? Okay. All right. So that's these items right here. Now let me show you another small area that I have. Over here are mostly my cleaning supplies. So I have the Clorox wipes. Um, you know, remember that deal from Family Dollar and Dollar Tree. I have the Febreze fabric sprays. These ones I just got from Walgreens recently. The other ones from Clarence Sales and other sales in the past. Um, so that's my Febreze and Airwick and Glade. Here are some of my cleaning supplies. As you guys recently seen, I got these Dawn dish soaps from Walgreens. Um, a lot of these game deals and stills that came from, um, Dollar General, right here we have um, Pine Saw, we have the Clorox, and we have the little coupons like buy two, get a dollar off. These were hot deals and steals at the Dollar Tree that I executed on. Okay, guys, so Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree, women, Lysol, Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree. The bigger ones are from other stores, of course. Um, I got some clearance, cleaning supplies that I got from Walgreens, other videos that I've had. Um, here are my some Fabuloso, Mr. Clean, all these um, soft scrubs. There was definitely a deal with soft scrubs at Walgreens one point in time. It was like buy one, get one free. And then they had a coupon. It was buy one, get one free. So it made both of them free. And all you had to do was pay taxes. So I have a video for that. Um, it's pretty cool. Um, I was super excited about that. So we cleaned up on that. And then here's some just overflow of items that I have that I haven't yet put up yet. Just some more Clorox wipes and some detergent um not detergent <laughs> dishwashing liquid some candles and etc so yeah this is my stockpile y'all this is part of it this is what your girl working with six months i've been doing this for six months over here is some of my paper products so i have all paper products kind of stacked right here and it goes all the way down kind of just pack 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 stack stack stacks this is all paper towels tissue paper 
have tissue paper back here. I have some garbage bags right here. I have some of my wipes from the Kleenex Hot Deal and still that glitch. I got boxes of these, <laughs> um, more tissue paper. So this is my paper area for my overflow, for my garbage bags and things of that nature that I have in this area here. This is what six months of couponing looks like, ladies and gentlemen. And remember, when you're out here couponing, executing these hot deals and stills, make sure that you're, I know we're saving money, and make sure you're actually saving money. So a quick tip is that maybe every other store or every other, every other receipt you keep, you take that savings that you save that you would have spent. So you save $20, and say you would have spent that $20 typically if you went to the store without those coupons. Take that $20 and put it in a jar. Watch how much fast your money grows, ladies and gentlemen. Like, invest that money into something. The money that you're saving, you should be invested into a new couch, a new furniture, a new hairdo, a vacation, an investment, a small business. Sometimes we get so geeked on saving that we keep spending and spending and spending, and then eventually it doesn't end up being a savings anymore. So what I do is every other receipt and or every receipt, Sometimes every receipt, it depends on how I'm feeling. I look at the savings on there. I take that money out of my purse. I put it in a jar. I put it in a jar. And because I've done that for six months, I'm able to take my family to Florida this summer. And I'm super excited. And that's all from saving. That's all from me saying, oh, I spent $3, but I saved 16 Wow, I would have spent this. I would have spent $18. I would have spent $19 if I didn't do this couponing. Wow, I'm going to take this $16 in savings, and I'm going to put it in a jar. And with that money add up, because I wanted to show for something. I want my coupon to show for more things than just products. I wanted to show that couponing has helped change my life, pay a bill, make me debt free pay a loan off, buy me a new car, do something for my kids. I want to say couponing has helped me grow, not just my stockpile, but my financial, spiritual, and mental growth as well. That's all part of financial. People always think that financial or wealth or growth has to be money. It doesn't have to be money. Sometimes happiness is money. That's wealth. Okay, so wealth can be counted on your mental stability. So make sure you're taking this money that you're saving on these material things and you are invested into something long term for you and your family that's going to help you grow and sustain and build happiness and everything. So done rambling, but I just want to tell you guys to start saving so as much as possible. So yes, I have this huge stockpile of all this stuff. But it benefits me because what I would have spent here, I was able now to take my daughter to Dairy Queen and buy her a treat or get her some new tennis shoes or whatever it was because now I'm splitting the cost of my bill and I'm also able to invest and have more money for things to my liking. So thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate y'all. The love and support is unconditional. Without you guys, I wouldn't even have this stockpile. If it wasn't for your love and support and telling me to keep going, girl, keep going. We love your videos, girl. I would not be here. I would have been gave up a long time ago because couponing is not all fun and games. And I would turn this camera around and look at y'all, but I got a face mask on right now. But uh, <laughs> but couponing is not always fun. Sometimes there's hiccups. The stores are rude to us. Um, supplies are done. We have to redo our scenarios and keep trying and trying to get you guys the best scenarios, the best hot deals and steals possible. And sometimes people just don't appreciate that and they don't understand what goes behind the scenes. And I just want you guys know thank you guys for sticking with me please like comment and subscribe remember to teach what you know teach what you know learn what you need and care enough to share with others pass this video along to a family or friend and help them start saving thank you guys so much for all you do for me i love you and have a great day just forgot guys smash that like button Comment down below if you love, love and like this video. Thumbs up. Hit that notification bell so you'll get notified. Okay, guys? Okay? 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 <laughs>